We do over the next 24 hours, those temperatures really dropping. Even a bit of a chill in the air this morning as a cold front moves through, and that's the rain that we saw over the weekend. Well, that cold front's moved out and leaving us this gorgeous sunrise. Check out this picture in Homewood right now. This is a live look from our Storm Track Tower Camp in Homewood. Vulcan is pointing the way over the Magic City. Now, temperatures in Homewood 39 degrees currently, north wind at around 10 miles per hour, making it feel more like 33 out there. So, kiddos, make sure you've grabbed the coats, parents. Make sure the kids are dressed appropriately this morning. It is going to be a little chilly. Temperatures holding close to 40 as they step outside to be picked up for the bus. Now, we will see that clearing sky. It's rain free, so they don't need the rain gear. But let, let me point out, even though those temperatures this afternoon will be in the mid 50s, it will be windy outside, so it still may feel cool. I still think it's jacket weather for the kids later on this afternoon. All right, temperatures across the board this morning. Very evident to see where that cold front has lined up across the state. Uh, really west of that cold front, those temperatures have dropped into the 30s. You have 35 in Coleman, 37 in Double Springs, 38 in Fayette, but 50 in Rockford, 49 still in Alexander City. Winds really picking up out of the north, anywhere between 5 to 10 miles per hour gusting today, 15 to 20 miles per hour. So, folks, just be, be prepared for that. It could be a little blustery at times. The rain's gone, though. All of that wet weather is moving off to the east as that cold front pushes eastbound right along the eastern seaboard. Alabama is placed on the backside of this low. We're seeing this counterclockwise rotation of the atmosphere, so that's drawing in this drier, cooler air diving into the deep south. That will keep us a little chilly this morning in the 30s and 40s, but we will see a nice little warm up, thanks in part to some sunshine through the afternoon. Highs today in the upper 50s. We'll hit that around noontime today, and we'll stay there through middle of the afternoon. On average, we should be at around 50. This time of year, so I wouldn't say temperatures are too far off base. Uh, we did see about a quarter of an inch of rain yesterday, and we need some more rain to help out that deficit just a little bit, about three inches below. And it looks like we're going to see some of that wet weather. Tomorrow it's dry, Wednesday it's dry, but notice Thursday. I will be tracking that rain moving in. Good news is the rain should move out Friday. It will be dry as we round out the week and kick off the weekend.